On the job this morning, employees say they'll uh, they'll spend 30 to 60 minutes a week shopping this holiday season. 44% say that time does not hinder productivity. However, here to discuss how work shopping can be handled best by workers and employers, Rebecca Risk, Metro Market Manager for Robert Half in Providence. Thanks for coming in. Sure. This is the time everyone tries to get as much as they can in with the very little time that they have. And yes, everybody's probably guilty of sitting at their computer at work going to a website and maybe buying one or two things. How do you handle this? So I think every job's different. Right. Every company has different policies and procedures. You need to understand what they are. Right. Um, you know, you're there at work to get your job done mm -hmm. and to be productive. You have to keep that in mind. And you know, if you have the ability to layer in some shopping, you know, if it's if it's okay with your company and it's okay with within the policies and procedures there, then then so be it. Should employees, you know, I mean, should they kind of expect this going on? You know, companies that have uh, multiple people in them, I mean, they have to kind of of figure this is happening, right? Yeah, I, I mean, I think it's probably a no-brainer. A day like today, you know, where all everyone hears about is, you know, the holiday sales and whatnot. It's, it's to be expected that people are probably going to spend some time shopping. Right. Is there a time better that, you know, employers uh, may look past it, maybe a lunch break or something like that? Is that is it okay then? Yeah, I mean, I think, it, it, again, it depends on, you know, what the company policy and procedure is. Right. I think if you plan to shop online on any given day, you know, kind of look yourself in the mirror and say, how much time do I spend? I plan to spend shopping. If it's going to be excessive, if maybe you take the day off if it's not going to impact your your day you know maybe you can do it on your lunch break or on you know some downtime throughout the course of the day so how much impact does it have on companies so I think it's kind of interesting because you know if you think about it it actually might in, it enhance productivity because if an employee is spending you know say 30 minutes online shopping at lunchtime that's a whole lot better than going to the mall spending two hours being out of the office and not being productive at all right so I think it it, it depends on how people approach it but it could in enhance productivity versus hurt it. And also I would imagine too that some companies obviously they don't want you putting their their systems, their computer systems at risk and there are a lot of sites that you probably shouldn't be going to because of viruses and stuff like that. Yeah, I think um, you know people are de or companies are definitely very concerned about people visiting unsecured sites. So, right. you know, the best practice from a technology leadership perspective is absolutely to make sure that employees company wide are aware of best practices to avoid um, putting the company at risk. Okay, one more thing, and I know I'm not even sure that this would be. Is it okay that if stuff you've purchased to have it shipped to where you work? I've done it. <laughs> oh well, then it's okay. <laughs> I think, again, it depends she on policy okay. and procedure. <laughs> no, because some companies may frown upon it. I mean, they may say, you know, you probably shouldn't be doing that. But for safety reasons, so stuff doesn't get stolen sure. at your home, it's okay. Yeah, as long as you know that that's within the rules and that right. management's comfortable with it, I think it's okay. If it's not, then you should probably have things shipped to as home. As long as the 18-wheeler's not backing in right. and with a you know, forklift just dropping. And within <laughs> reason. Yeah. Within reason. All right. Yeah. Thanks so much, Rebecca. Mm -hmm. She was doing it, so it's okay. Uh, for more <laughs> on these job, job segments, you can head on over to roadshow.com.